Alright everybody, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'm going to finally, finally, once and for all, look at, oh someone's calling me, I'm going to finally look at Brian Dawkins, Weapon X. In the previous video, I looked at Steve Smith Sr., finally, you know, it's been, it's been months, I'm sorry, I apologise, and it's been months with this guy too, like everyone continues to ask, they continue to say, I cannot believe Jacob has not reacted to this man. Brian Dawkins, Weapon X. Let's do this. The quicker you're here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from, the only thing we know is... Oh. There ain't no time like the present. And... I don't know what video to watch. Brian Dawkins, The Wolverine, Brian Dawkins, Weapon X. The making of Weapon X. Let's do... Let's do this one. Now, Joseph Vincent videos, I feel like, tell a bit of a story. If any, you know, career changing moments happen, he's gonna cover it. So that's why I'm not going to look at Wikipedia beforehand. But I've never seen I've never seen Brian Dawkins in the flesh. Never seen a, what he looks like. Don't know what what position he plays. Nothing. So let's do this. Oh, actually, he's called the Minister of No. Is that who's the Minister of Defence? That's another person I need to look up. That's the next one. Actually, let me have a look. <laughs> I don't want Australian politics. Uh, NFL. Reggie White. Okay, he's next. Just do it so I can start commenting. I believe to talk about a player being the heart and soul of a team, but in the case of Brian Dawkins, the longest tenured athlete in the entire city of Philadelphia, it felt legit. Can y'all feel that? Can you feel that thing? That's me. Weapon X! Oh! Fucking hell! Fly like an eagle! See that coming? I like that visor, man. Let me 
This guy Dawkins. Um, I've always liked the X Men and they like caught with a Wolverine and how he is and the fact that he never backs down from a battle, the fact that he's intense all the time is something that invited me into that world. Let's go, Brian Dawkins. Let's have a look at his uh, his stats here. Played si 16 sec. Well, that's very similar to the last guy I looked at. Um, Steve Smith, 16 seasons. Except Smith was a wide receiver. He's 45 now. He was six foot. 210 pounds. I never know whether these weights are what they were when they were playing or what they are now. But anyway, 95 kilos. He went, fucking hell, 1996 draft. He played for the Eagles for 12 years. Once again, just like Steve Smith, went, for the, went to the Broncos for the last three seasons. I wonder why that was. He's a member of the 30 for 30 club of players who have at least 30 interceptions and 30 forced fumbles. He and Charles Tillman are the only players to record at least 35 of each. Forced fumbles have only been a recorded stat since 1991. He finished his career with the Eagles starting 182 of 183 games, 898 tackles, 34 interceptions, 32 forced fumbles, and 26 sacks! Holy shit, so on the on, in 2009, 13 years after coming into the league, he signed a five-year, $17 million contract. Head coach John Fox named Dawkins the starting strong safety to begin the regular season in 2011. He started in the season opener, collected a season high in nine combined tackles. On January 19th, 2012, it was announced that Dawkins would play in the 2012 Pro Bowl as a late injury replacement. For Pittsburgh Steelers safety Troy po po Polamalu, it's been a while since I looked at him, Troy Polamalu was literally like probably the fourth reaction I ever did. Crazy. After calling coach John Fox on April 23rd, 2012, Dawkins announced via Twitter that he was retiring from the NFL. His reasoning was that he wanted to retire while he was still healthy. That's very smart. He planned to stay in Colorado and wanted to begin coaching high school football that fall. And on April 28th, 2012, Dawkins announced that he would sign a one day contract and retire as a Philadelphia Eagle. That's awesome. The Eagles have retired only nine players' jerseys in franchise history, which goes back more than 20 years. The Eagles retired Dawkins number 20 in a ceremony at halftime of their September 30 game against the Giants. On February 4th, 2018, it was announced that Dawkins was vo voted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame. He joined Randy Moss, Brian Urlacher, Ray Lewis, 
and former Eagles teammate Cheryl Owens. Brian Erlacher. Erlacher. That's one that I need to do actually. We'll get on to that. Over the span of his career, Dawkins developed a reputation as a ball hawking safety and became the unquestioned leader of the Philadelphia Eagles defense. He earned the nickname Weapon X, a codename of Marvel character Wolverine. I did not know that. I thought it was just X-Men in general. As a captain and unquestioned leader, Dawkins has acted as a mentor to multiple players early in their career. Chris Harris Jr. credits Dawkins and Champ Bailey for urging the Denver Broncos coaching staff to play him as an undrafted rookie after he showed promise and performed well in practice squad. And Chris Harris Jr. is now playing for the Broncos after being undrafted. Okay. 224 games, which is freaking crazy. Let's have a look at this. 224. He is equal 119th. Brian Dawkins. And he was in nine Pro Bowl games, but no Super Bowls. No, he was. No, did he have a Super What's this? As an administrator, Dawkins won his first Super Bowl when the Eagles won Super Bowl 52 last year against the Patriots. On July 30th, 2016, Dawkins returned to the Eagles to take a role on the team's scouting staff. He was given a new role of football operations executive to assist with player development. He won his first Super Bowl whilst in that role. Okay, so he got one. Oh, I'm bloody happy about that. All right. Brian Dawkins, um, that's it man, that was my reaction finally to Brian Dawkins, Weapon X, now I know who he is. So uh, let's move on to the next one, which is going to be Reggie White, and then we've got Brian Erlacher. So stay tuned guys, if you have liked this video, please press like, the support does not go unnoticed. If you want to subscribe, please do, if you want to leave a comment, hit me up down below. I've got the best comment section in the world, so do that, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.